What is up, YouTube? This is the executive producer, Amir here. Sanchez45 is on vacay, so good for him. Uh, he's coming here now with some breaking Redskins news. Redskins will be releasing linebacker Mason Foster. Hmm. Maybe Ruben Foster miraculously recovered. I think non-ACL takes about a year, so... Maybe Zach Vigil is going to be the starter next to uh, probably Sean Dion. That's what I'm guessing. I guess we'll find out. Training camp does open in the next couple days. Of course, there's some other drama going on there. Trent Williams is currently holding out, which is, you know... To be expected from early reports that he is unhappy with his contract and unhappy with the medical staff, which I believe, you know, we're all unhappy with the medical staff on this team. Well, let's hope that they work it out soon, just like they work it out with Brandon Sheriff and his pending deal. I'd rather not lose two key members of the offensive line but if so be it, I'd rather lose Williams than Sheriff at this point. A lot of you may agree to disagree. That's fine. That's your opinion. But Williams can't play a full season. Sheriff's only been hurt once in four years. This is coming up on his fifth year. And we may need to draft uh, some new offensive linemen next year. Um... I still believe that this team is not going to do too well, unfortunately. If you think that makes me a crappy Redskins fan, go ahead. Leave the comment below. But I don't think I'm a crappy Redskins fan for thinking and being realistic. Realism is what holds us to the ground. It keeps us from having our head up in the sky all the time. So, with that, uh, I do think with the schedule that we have, with Jay Gruden's swang song being played right now, and this basically being an audition year for Kevin McConnell, as uh, reports do say that Kevin McConnell loves the way Dwayne Haskins works out and loves the way he's developing so far okay then we know Dwayne Haskins is more of a Kevin McConnell pick than versus the Jay Gruden pick definitely a Dan Snyder pick and that's not saying I don't have faith in Dwayne Haskins he hasn't even taken a snap in the NFL yet I mean we were all ready to anoint Griffin as the next savior of everything back in 2012 yet I always had the back of my mind that Kirk Cousins was the better player Griffin is backing up Lamar Jackson and Cousins is the re interceptions in Minnesota so uh, point mildly proven oh, no idea but we should definitely Look out for what training camp is going to bring in the next few days. We should be excited regardless. I'm still going to watch. I'm still going to order my Sunday ticket. Still going to watch every single week and be disappointed every single week. But you know what? I won't have any other way because these are my guys. All right. So in the words of the great Sanchez 405, as we say here on On the Warpath, love, peace, and hail. And we'll talk to you guys later. Peace.